All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. We're going to do an update on our boat project here. Last weekend, we managed to get the rest of our trailer sanded down and cleaned up. We shot two coats of primer on it, and then we shot two coats, really probably about two and a half, almost three coats of um, high heat black, especially what you use on barbecue grills. I got a quart of it at Walmart for like 10 bucks, and... Uh, it covered really well. I bought a, a, a spray gun at Harbor Freight for like 20 bucks, and it did a did a really good job. It it um, it stretched the paint out, and we're really pleased with the way it looks. I'm getting ready to put the new bunks on. I bought new hardware for that here in the rear, and uh, I'm going to do a little bit of an. I'm going to do two things in this video. One, I want to show you the trailer, and then I'm going to do an unboxing boxing over here I bought I uh, went to Bass Pro Shop and they had side what they call side guides or side bunks um, in a everything you needed was in the package including the bunk itself so I'm gonna shut the camera off and set it up and I'm gonna show you exactly what came in the box and um, I think it may be a little bit cheaper way to do it versus buying the hardware on your own and then having to go and buy wood and carpet and all that stuff this everything you need comes in the box so I'm going to turn the camera off now, set it up, and then I'll show you what we have in the box for the, the side guides. All right, guys, so here's the bunk boards or guidelines that they're calling them. It has the Bass Pro Shop logo on it. I'm willing to bet somebody else is making the, making them for them, and they're just putting their, their logo on it. Um, but everything you need comes in, the, comes in the box, including the hardware to attach it to your your trailer so I'm gonna set the camera down now we'll pull some of the stuff out and I'll show you what exactly is in the box all right so let's I'll show you what we got in the box here so it's got carpeted bunks already in there Side bracing. Hardware. Bolts, washers, all the hardware you need to install it. to put it on to uh, attach it to your trailer. And then the hardware to screw into your bunks to attach it to your side rails there. So um, I'll get these put on and we'll see what, and I'll show you what they look like after I get them, get them installed. And I'll let you know how big of a pain in the ass it is to do it. All right, guys, got the, the guide ons Put on super simple not nearly a big a pain as I was expecting um, it did take two hands once I got uh, to the point to where I was putting the the guides themselves on up on the top uh, but other than that all the hardware was there instructions were super easy um, I'll show you a little close-up view there was really only two things you needed to do uh, one was depending on how your trailer was set up if you had like a um, middle brace you the brackets went on a little bit differently and I'll, I'm going to turn the camera off and show you kind of a close-up view and I'll try to explain what that uh, about more about that but um, really easy I think they're going to work well price was right everything you need came in the box or you know for both sides hardware the bunks themselves came carpeted all you had to do was screw them in to attach them I would I would certainly recommend this product and, and use it again Okay, so here's what I was talking about. If you had a middle brace here, all you did instead of uh, my these screws or brackets right here, this overlaps. If you had a middle bracket right here or another middle section to your trailer, you just didn't overlap. You put 
one bracket through here, one bracket through here, and you were good. I don't have any kind of bracing back here. I didn't want it to be this far back on the trailer, so I just moved it up, and you just overlap. And um, this bracket right here that goes over this one has a little notch out of it, and it kind of kind of cups that, kind of a U-shape in, in the um, middle of it, and it just cups that bracket. But it's, it's on there pretty solid. I don't think it's going to go anywhere. Like I said, I would totally recommend this product again. I would use it again. Um, I, like I, I believe it was $123 from Bass Pro. I'll see if I can find a couple of other places for it online, and I'll link to it if I can. But certainly reasonable for, for everything. Um, five foot long, guide-ons, everything was there. Um, I, don't, I don't think you can go wrong using this product. So that's this week's video. Uh, we have our trailer finished now. We're gonna next week. I'm gonna start tearing this rotted transom out. So if you want to keep up with the project itself, um, hit the subscribe down subscribe button down below. Uh, if you like the video, give us a thumbs up, and uh, we'll see you next week. Thanks.